Uh, welcome to this video today. We're going to be looking at the uh, techniques and strategy of Jim Rogers. Most people who watch financial news channels will be familiar with the guy, the guy with the bow tie, straight talking guy, very witty. And he is one of the world's greatest investors. You know, he was with George Soros at the Quantum Fund and now he runs uh, Rogers Holdings. He's got fantastic track record of long term gains. Here we're going to look at uh, some techniques that he uses in his strategy and some tips and advice from one of the best traders. And one of the most important points he makes, and he did it in an interview with Jack Schwager in Market Wizards, is basically to be patient. You know, if there is nothing to do in the markets that you see, or you don't see high odds trades, resist the temptation to trade. It's like he said, you know, he waits for the high odds setups and only trades when it's as easy as he puts it as picking up money lying in the corner. Most traders just trade too much and they think that the more they trade, the more effort they make, the, the better their rewards will be. But this isn't true in Forex. You actually have to be patient and wait for the best high odds trades and doing less is actually more effective. So don't be tempted to trade. Always wait for those high odds trades. He also makes the point that you know the the investment world sometimes can look very easy, and it's very easy to get into conventional thinking and run with the crowd. And of course, this leads to disaster because we all know that ninety percent of traders lose. And one thing I would say about Jim Rogers, he comes over as a very humble, very sort of nice guy. Um, and he actually, whenever he's interviewed on TV, he very often throws in the words. Yeah, when they ask him where something is going, I'm terrible at market timing. And I think a lot of traders can learn from this as well, because you don't need perfect market timing to win at Forex trading. You need to wait and get confirmation of trading signals and trade the reality of what's on the chart rather than where you think it's going to go. So don't be worried about missing the bottom, uh, you know, buying it or selling the top. It can't be done. If you made you know, 50% of every major trend in profits, you'd be a very rich person. So market timing, you know, traders are obsessed with it. Don't be obsessed with it. It's, you know, basically getting in at the a time when the odds are at their best and then running the profit uh, as far as you can. And Jim Rogers, he's a long-term trend follower. And long-term trend following is, you know, probably the best way to make money in Forex trading. And yet very few traders actually you know, do it. Yeah, it's retail traders. They're, they're all scalping and day trading. That is low odds of success. You're trading the market noise. Um, you know, most day traders, if not all day traders, probably lose. And yet it's a, a really popular way of trading. Traders think they can restrict risk and basically predict in those short time frames. It's impossible. If you want to look at the strategy more pro traders use than any other, it's definitely Forex trend following. So I would have a look at that. Um, you know, it really is the strategy of the pros. And another thing with George, uh, George Soros, I mean, Jimmy Rogers, is that he basically is a very long term trader, but he also takes into account the fundamentals. It is the fundamentals that drive long term trends. OK, charts can be used for timing, but if you know the fundamentals behind the charts, then you can have more confidence in holding those trends and running them for profit. In terms of money management, uh, uh, Jim Rogers' advice was my best advice is uh, don't lose money, um, which isn't really uh, very helpful. Um, but it is actually obviously true. You know, any great trader um, pays close attention to money management. You actually have to, and you know, just keep your losses small. And I think with, with Jim Rogers, he's a very sort of down to earth sort of guy. And he, he was saying once, you know, avoid thinking that you know, an investment is simple or a trade is simple when we live in such a complex world. And basically don't get carried away with the crowd, which I think is probably you know, sound advice for any trader. So my main points and the main advice and tips I take from Jim Rogers would be the first one would be the patience. You know, patience is just something that can really make you more profits quickly, straight away, if you become more patient and just focus on high odds trades. Um, long term trading, it is the best way to make money in Forex. And also, it's, you know, you're not going to spend so much time on your trading. And 
you know, trade the odds, um, focus on the long term, uh, and basically always be aware of what can go wrong. Uh, yeah, Jim Rogers is um, you know, a, a really legendary investor, and I think that would be my main tips I would take from him. Try and read the interview with him in Market Wizards if you can. It's a classic investment book and a classic interview. And you know, whenever he's on TV, I always tune in and watch him and always get a bit of insight. So thank you for watching this video on uh, Jim Rogers' tips, strategies, and techniques for success. And I'll speak to you again soon. Take care. Have a good day.